Good afternoon, fellow riders. Today is day two of the special Huat episode for Chinese New Year. And uh, the time now is 3 p.m. Uh, morning, I did not do any deliveries, even though the incentives were there, because I was simply too tired from yesterday's ride. And I had to finish editing the video, which is out on YouTube right now. So if you want to see this entire Deliver with JMove uh, series, do i do highly recommend going back and uh, watching from the beginning uh, so that you can get a full perspective so uh 3 p.m turned on my app immediately boom got my first order and i'm on the way to pick it up right now now the fee boost right is supposed to start at 5 p.m uh, but however there is a plus two dollar spot bonus right now uh, which is a good thing i'm not complaining or anything so we go and pick up the order first first pickup is actually from fatty bomb bomb and as you can see a lot of the shops have already closed already uh, eateries uh. so today it's gonna be i don't know how it's gonna be uh just gonna try my luck on see whether i can get orders or not but i'm just keeping my hopes very moderate in case any of you are wondering why i am not in the grab uniform the reason is very simple uh, today chinese new year eve uh, i really don't know whether there will be orders or not so uh, i will be doing multi-platform uh, between deliveroo and uh, grab food i see which platform gives me the orders and then uh, i can uh, hopefully do those platforms however i did book a grab shift uh, from uh, 5 to 8 pm uh, so I don't have much hopes for today, <laughs> to, to be honest. Uh, but we just see, la, you know, see how earnings are like today, uh, you know, on the eve of Chinese New Year. Hopefully, it's what time. Hello, hi, 623. Hi, uh, yes. Okay. How's your day so far? <laughs> <laughs> every year. Yeah, every year this time, ah, uh, yeah, lah, sorry, lah. Okay, okay. okay. The mind. Other okay, no, except for. Yeah, it's okay, the mind. Just tahan for another, another three more days, lah. Uh. Ah, two drinks, sir. Uh. Yes, yeah, so drink. Okay, thank you. Okay. On my way to pick up the next order, it's a group order. So just now, I had an order for this uh, delivery, Tokyo Shukudu. Uh, before I got the McDonald's order, however, the order only paid me four dollars, uh, and then you know the waiting time on it was simply horrendous. I went to collect the Grab McDonald's order, and then I came back down, and the order was still not ready, so just rejected it. And anyway, at five dollars and fifty cents for the McD order, which is nearer to deliver compared to the Roo order, the Grab order is uh, much more worth it for me. Uh. The Mr. Bean inside the polyclinic, the polyclinic is closed. So I have to let the customer and the uh, Grab CS know. So I have already cancelled the order. However, it has started raining. Uh, I have to put on my raincoat and then go and pick up the next order. As I was putting on my raincoat, yeah, I got another grouped order. I'm a law-abiding citizen because I've got camera there. So. I'm a very law-abiding citizen for now. Okay, I think we are on fire. The double stack became a triple stack. Uh, 875 283. 875? Yeah, and 283. The rain is really pouring. It's uh, really, really heavy weather. Wow, I really hope nothing happens to this e-bike, man. Because, you know, it's on loan and I don't, I don't want to pay for any damages or anything. But uh, but in all honesty, uh, the tires are, uh, wow, they are really very super grippy. Uh. The riding in this kind of wet weather con conditions, I, I can really feel the the stability of the tire in this kind of weather so i i don't know this tire what kind of properties it has but it's really good and combined with the hydraulic brakes uh, well, this is uh, a okay uh, combined with the hydraulic brakes 
and these kind of uh, tires the e-bike is it's really good to ride in the in the rain uh. however please don't do this uh. you know if you can avoid riding in the rain don't ride uh, because it's not safe so don't be an idiot like me my grab shift has actually started already and it is the new year the second day the chinese new year incentive of two dollars for every order however the first order i go to which i got during the incentive uh, our shop is closed uh. it seems to be like a recurring problem every chinese new year you know if you see my last year's video right it's also the same thing i encounter the same thing also so anyway <laughs> thankfully i got another order i just picked up just beside only uh, fusion express already picked it up and headed to the customer to deliver it uh. so officially my grab shift has started together with the chinese new year incentive uh, 5 pm to 8 pm the next order was a uh, Four, four group orders four from wingstop and one from ichikudo ramen the uh, four wingstop orders are uh, what well, i got them within like uh, 10 minutes of arriving even though there were a lot of riders uh, so that was really fast yeah, hello hi uh, 550 yeah here uh, okay thank you yeah uh, no now drizzling only la uh, 903 903 yeah you yeah sign already Thank okay thank you yeah happy new year yeah you guys hear that sound that ringing sound well that is the sound of uh, food delivery platforms machine asking the restaurant to accept the order i guess a lot of uh, restaurants forgot to off the machine uh. yeah by the way uh, you know the <laughs> previous video the day one what video right i think i make a lot of uh, silly mistakes uh. Uh, and some of you actually pointed it out to me in the comments so like uh quen yong or quen chong like uh, sorry bro uh, if i got your name wrong uh. Uh, so he and alvin yu chow right uh, from yu chow vlogs they both pointed out uh, it's not really like did i lose my job or did the company close down uh, and they mentioned that i shouldn't say like that i should actually say close for chinese new year lah. you know yeah so yeah it's uh, my company gave an extra day off for chinese new year which by the way uh, my boss also got subscribed to this channel lah. so uh for our boss you see this i'm very sorry uh, i don't mean that the company closed down uh, i actually mean ha how uh, nice and what a uh, amazing boss you are you know give us this extra day off beyond what mom has uh, stipulated yeah you are really very uh, fantastic all our uh, staff our colleagues family everybody benefit from the prosperity of the company yeah yeah so quad boss quad boss quad boss yeah okay uh, then Davy also pointed out that the statement that i made of uh, 8 uh, sorry 9:20 a.m to 8 40 a.m is wrong it should be 8 40 p.m because that would technically be like 24 hours right yeah so this is what happens when you do editing huh, for late night huh? <laughs> right after you do your de delivery rights hello uh, 859 <laughs> this pickup is uh, I think it's a home based uh, business uh, maybe like a home baker or something like that hey hi bro so waiting uh. <laughs> hello hello, hello hi uh, 506 506 yeah correct thank you okay. oh okay thank you. okay thank you yeah okay happy new year yeah. okay uh, it's uh, apparently some kind of tea milkshake i don't know what it is uh anyway uh time now is uh, 7 58 uh, so this will be the last orders for which will have the chinese new year incentive so let's go and deliver this time now is uh, 8 20 pm 
and I have uh, the grab shift is over Chinese New Year incentive for day two is also over and uh, however after delivering to that last customer right I had a uh, another order pick up and it's pretty near here it's it's within Senja itself so just gonna go ahead and see how many more orders I can like complete uh, for tonight before heading back home hi 760 okay thank you Whoa. Uh, Grab Express. Uh. Uh, 185. 185. Yeah. Oh, okay. Get to do. Thank you. This is so weird, guys. Uh, so, I had this order just now, right? A Grab Express order from uh, Greenridge Shopping Center. I sent it to this block at uh, Sega. And then I got the next order, which is again from Greenridge Shopping Center. And it's to the exact same block in Sega. Grab Express don't have stacked orders, right? Yeah, I think Grab Express don't have stacked. Well, my this is my third order from Greenridge again, and it's a Grab Express, but however, it's to a different area, lah. Okay, thank you. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, I will. Uh, cute guy. Although I hate the place, uh, the staff is quite friendly. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I guess this will be the final order. The reason being, this play, this delivery is gonna bring me back to Teck Wai. That's right. The delivery is to Jalan Teck Wai, and from there back to Teck Wai Lane, it's uh, pretty easy for me. So I'm just gonna call it a day. And then, uh, as usual, on my ride back. We will see what are the earnings gonna be like, and uh, the other breakdown as usual. I started at 3 p.m. and the last order was delivered at 10:30 p.m. Thus, the total hours work is seven and a half hours. On day two, the order meter starting reading was at 77 kilometers, and by the time I finished at 10:30 p.m., the reading stood at. 121.9 kilometers thus the total distance traveled is 44.9 kilometers on the battery side i was left with two bars at the end of the day i completed a total of 19 jobs which got me 100 dollars and 38 cents on the delivery earnings during the northwest shift of 5 to 8 pm i completed a total of 10 jobs which means I should have gotten 10 jobs for my Chinese New Year incentive. But I don't know why, but for some reason, the, the Chinese New Year incentive which has been calculated and paid out to me only reflects 9 jobs. So where did that one job disappear to? And it's not that cancelled job also, uh, because I did go in and uh, check the the payout and everything. So I, I, I can't figure it out. But anyway... Uh, I have contacted Grab regarding this discrepancy, and uh, but I don't think I'm gonna receive an answer uh, uh, immediately because you know it's Chinese New Year holidays, right? So hopefully next week they will tell me what to do, what happened with that extra order. So once you have the total net earnings, the weekday quest, as well as the Chinese New Year incentive, my total comes out to be $139.38 on the total earnings and it's $18.59 per hour which is one of my highest and by mileage it pays me $3.10 per kilometers. And we have come to the end of this episode. Do remember to subscribe to this channel if you have not as I will be posting my Chinese New Year earnings uh, and delivery orders on the JMove MC Pro for the next couple of days. Ride safe, be safe. I wish you all good earnings. This is G-Man signing off.